This is Jimmy Houston Outdoors. Rising with the morning sun, I got no work today. You might find me up on the bayou or over in the ocean bay. I'd be fishing on a mountain stream or a lake down in Tennessee. Might as well grab your fishing pole, come and go along with me. Jimmy Houston is not only an accomplished tournament angler, he is also one of the best known, most recognizable, and highly regarded personalities on television. Both on the screen and on the trail, he catches bass. Lots of them. Jimmy can't remember a time when he didn't fish. In 1966, when he was a college senior, he won the Oklahoma State Championship, and two years later, the Cooks and Kid entered the BASS tournament at Lake Eufaula, Alabama, finishing sixth and proving he could compete with the best. Since then, he's participated in 15 Bassmaster Classics, won 10 national tournaments, and placed among the top money winners in more than 100 events. In 1976, he was named Angler of the Year by BASS, and 10 years later, he won the title for a second time. As his achievements multiplied, so did his fans. Attracted by Houston's skill and personality, they came to watch him weigh in fish, tell a story or joke, or dispense fishing advice. These same qualities made him a TV natural, and in 1976, Jimmy Houston Outdoors debuted. So I have the dip net. Yeah. Uh, we're still out here. Uh, so this is a half hour show is all this. That's I'd okay. like you to get the fish up here where we can uh, dip net him and take a look at him. So far all we've seen is you with a Shimano rod bent double for the last 47 Seven minutes. Seven. Jimmy's laugh and signature haircut are familiar to his loyal viewers. And 30 years later the show remains one of the most popular outdoor programs. If it's important to a bass, it's important to Jimmy. And on television and in his articles and books, he offers tips and shares secrets of tournament fishermen. If you fish till you're a hundred, he says, you should still be learning on the last day on the water. Always upbeat and positive, his words are instructive, insightful, and entertaining. He reminds us we don't have to catch lunkers to have fun. He has fun fishing every time he's out on the water, and he wants to share that message, knowing the survival of the sport depends on people getting excited about it. Houston continues to be a crowd favorite at tournaments and personal appearances. In 1990, he was inducted into the National Freshwater Fishing Hall of Fame, and in 2002, into the Professional Bass Fishing Hall of Fame. Together with his wife, Chris, a bass fishing champion in her own right, he's been successful in business, too, with boat dealerships, travel and production companies, and the Jimmy Houston Outdoor Store. He's been described as a type A personality with the energy of a ping pong ball, the personality of a circus clown, the business mind of Donald Trump, and the compassion of a neighborhood minister. For more than three decades, this bass legend has been entertaining and educating folks about the outdoors with a love and enthusiasm for the sport that hasn't diminished. In recognition, the IGFA warmly welcomes Jimmy Houston to the Fishing Hall of Fame.